many staff, many ministers and PSS who I have worked with. Mr. Speaker, today I am making my last speech, maybe, of the 12th Parliament because I had to fly from Mandera in order to make sure that the Huduma Bill, which contravenes various articles, Article 118 on public participation, Article 201, Article 221, Article 226, Article 229, Article 94, Sub-Article 6, Standing Order 118, Clause 8 of that bill, Mr. Speaker, Article 31 on the right to privacy, Article 24 of the Constitution, Standing Order 133, Sub-Article 5, Mr. Speaker, this bill is not different from the sessional paper of 9, 1 of 1963 that wants to marginalize, that wants to create two sets of citizens. There are people in government, Mr. Speaker, that they feel the Somalis and the Muslims community and many other minorities are visitors. I want to tell them on their face, Kenya belongs to all of us. Mr. Speaker, through your help and the petition I brought to this house, thousands of them who their data was captured in the refugee camp got their ID cards. Mr. Speaker, my party leader, transferred Garissa Wajia Mandera, and he committed two things, that never again will the people of the North be denied their constitutional citizenship rights. And two, never again will the people who profess Islamic faith and the Somali community be killed through extrajudicial killing. Mr. Speaker, I want to say it here, it is very sad that this parliament allowed this government to borrow seven trillion and this house through coercion and bribery and intimidation approved the 10 trillion. But when the Kenya Kwanzaa takes over, we will stabilize the economy. And please, please let us not allow, let us not fight Bitumba. Iwapo unapenda habari na zokuletea, basi subscribe kwenye channel hii ili uwe unapata uhondo kila wakati. Shukran.